Pacific Beach, Washington with the Ham Radio Adventures Club Whiskey Echo 4 Delta X-Ray. Today is Balloon Day. Last year we attempted to launch a Pico Balloon, but uh, had a couple technical difficulties. So we upped the game a little bit to ensure that hopefully at least one balloon will make it skyward. Let's check this out. So this is Heath, and he's going to tell us what he has in his hands and how we're going to hopefully make this happen. All right, this is a Traquito. Hopefully I pronounced that right. A track Traquito. Okay. It is a, a Pi Pico on one side, and then soldered on the other is what they call the backpack. And the backpack has a GPS, the signal generator, and a thermometer on it for sending temperature. And the top is the solar panels, three volts of very fragile solar panels. <laughs> We're hoping this success. So, um, program this. It transmits whisper. It transmits uh, one, two, two. Uh, was it two minute cycles? Yep. One two minute cycle is uh, information like call sign and grid square and the power it's transmitting at. The next one is a telemetry. It encodes the telemetry into the uh, whisper message. And on the third one, it uh, transmits some custom messages. So we have an ID for each of these because we're going to, we have seven built, but we're giving a number for each one of these so that we can keep track of them. Uh, the website that, uh, that was put together gets that data from WhisperNet and a couple of these other Whisper um, aggregators and puts it in there. So it has a tool so you can track it around the world, hopefully, as far, <laughs> as, far as it goes. Nice. Um, yeah. I think total weight on this is, feels like 20, 30 grams. Wow. And uh, hopefully, yeah, hopefully we get a successful launch and we and get a successful. These are for 20 meters. They'll work, they'll work on any band from 2,200 meters up to oh, okay. about six meters. So you can set that. So we're, but we, we just chose 20 meters. 20 meters okay. because, yeah. Because why not? Yeah. <laughs> and and how, th how are we uh, attaching these to the balloons and talk about the antenna and stuff? Yep. So we're going to have very thin Kevlar cord. This goes from this up to the balloon. But in parallel to this, and actually taped to it, is going to be one half of the antenna. So it's basically a, a 20 meter dipole, one going up along the wire. So it's going to go about 17 feet and hook onto the balloon. And on the bottom, we're just going to have 17 feet of wire just hanging off the bottom. And what gauge wire? 32 gauge wire, a little magnet <laughs> wire. So it's like a, a it's like a strand of hair. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Very fragile. So, but today is nice and calm, and looks like the sun's out. So we're going to yeah. give it a try. All right, well, let's go check out the fizzy lifting drinks we're gonna to use to get these up in the air. Thanks, Heath. Yep, no problem. So this is Mike, he's the uh, fizzy lifting gas expert, and he's gonna explain what we got going on for the balloons to actually get these things up in the air. What's going on, Mike? Okay, so today we got a couple teams broken out. We got a, a launch team, I'm the, uh, the balloon team, and we had another team that's building their radios and antennas. Uh, this is going to be the balloon today. It's a... Uh, uh, 60 inch mylar balloon. Uh, today for lifting, we have hydrogen. We're gonna fill it into this balloon uh, and we're gonna tear out the weight of the payload. So today we've calculated the payload to be 95, 95 grams. And so we're gonna start filling this and, and uh, get it to a neutral buoyancy. I, I put together just a, a crude little counterweight. And so what we're gonna do, <laughs> just some uh, Allen keys. What we're gonna do is continue to fill this until it just starts achieving neutral buoyancy. And then we know that we're gonna be, we're gonna have enough lift uh, to get the radio up in the air. So when we're done filling, we're going to seal the neck of the balloon. We have a, uh, a heat sealer and we're gonna lay this across the heating element, press it down and it'll seal the balloon. That way we can make sure no gases escape. So we're thinking thinking because the wind is so low we don't even need to go to the beach which i still think we should go to the beach because it's pretty but we got a bunch of these balloons so we're going to try launching this first balloon right here from the ham radio adventures what do we call this ground zero we'll go with that so i'm feeling pretty optimistic about this this should be pretty cool here's our engineers figuring out the best way to deploy this without destroying it and just for, uh, maybe you can see it, but that's how thin the wire is for the antenna and then the Kevlar, whatever it is. I mean, it's probably one atom thick. 
Yeah. This is the balloon procession making our way over to the launch site. We have all these crawlers here. If anything, they'll be strain relief on those too. It's no duct tape, but we're hoping this will work. So, Ducks do fly. Some quick release mechanism yeah. here. Oh, 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 oh. oh buddy. There she goes. There she goes. She's up. She's up. I think that was your best. That's, job, that's, that is a success, right. a marked China. improvement from last year. So we're good at launching. We have been sending out balloons all day. Uh, I think we have, this will be the fourth or fifth balloon. I think, I want to say this is the fifth balloon launch. We have been picked up from some of the uh, whisper things. So stuff is working. One of the balloons had... Uh, they came out with a with a they made one with a battery on it. They took some batteries from some of those like cigarette vape things. Uh, so four you know three point seven volt four point two charged, just lithium polymer batteries. That one's up and working, and now uh, they're gonna send another one up. So we don't know which one was working, but we suspect. Oh look, there's a rainbow. How about that? Aww. It's a reading rainbow. That means this one's gonna work. So this one has more solar panels. So hopefully, we think the problem was. Um, just keeping the, the boards powered with three solar panels, or six rather, um, wasn't enough voltage, so we're adding more, more Puyor. And as always, when I say we, I mean them and not myself. Also a new addition for this particular balloon launch is Mike's margarita has uh, come out, so. Just one glass. Yeah. Just one glass. Just right? one glass. Just one. I only had one, Ossifer. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there we go. Another successful launch. Sweet. Whiskey Echo 4 Delta X-ray on the Whisper thing.